Hello and welcome to another episode of On The Tech. Today I'll be showing you how to get the Welcome Back program package on your PSP without having a PS3 as I've heard some messages that people are having trouble doing this. So what you do is, um, by, by the way this is the tutorial to do it on the UK or the EU website but I'm pretty sure the other websites such as the US and Jap Japanese um, they'll all have similar PlayStation websites. So you go into a search engine on your internet browser and type in PlayStation or PlayStation Store or something that will lead you to the PlayStation's website, official we website. And then you wait for it to load. And in the corner there, you click on sign in. And then this will pop up. Now you're going to want to enter your so-called old password and email as after it's after the PlayStation Network has been hacked they've all been they're not accepting them anymore and you have to change it in case the hackers use your go onto your account again. So you use your old one or what you would normally use before the hack and then you click sign in now when you click sign in it will pop up saying that is we're not accepting your password anymore and we have sent to you an email and on that email is a um, a link a hyperlink to a website and on on their website to a page and on that page you would enter your new password, your selected password, and then I'll tell you what to do from there on your PSP. So once you've turned your PSP on, you go to the PlayStation Store. Just to warn you, you may have to do an update if you haven't done one recently, as since the PlayStation Store has been hacked, I know it was a, a while ago supposedly, but you there have been a couple of updates since then, if you're a person that doesn't like updates or a hacker or something so you click on PlayStation Store so I just need to cover up my real email okay so then you type in your email and your new password which you've selected and you sign in and it may take a bit longer than normal but you should successfully be in okay so you click on to latest and there should be welcome back so you click on welcome back sometimes this happens to me I'm not sure what happens to other PlayStation Network users but it says no content found and you have to retry it a few times and eventually it will come back but it's actually in my saved downloads so anyway you normally there will be four games I think there are and you choose two out of them and then you download them and when you click download as normal as if you paid for it but obviously you haven't as it's free and there we go I'm downloading for free One Nation Racers as part of the PlayStation Network's Welcome Back program so thank you PlayStation Network if you're interested in any more tutorials on your PSP and want to maybe you want to request some, please leave a comment down below. Thanks for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and goodbye.